Hi, my name's Derek Reich, and we're here to do a big interview with Dan Rather and Sammy Hagar. This space here is great. It's Sammy's uh, studio. Um, not as big as I'd wanted. <laughs> so we're gonna be a little more constricted to do what we wanna do. For most interview shoots, the reality of it is, it's, it's like 8% shooting and 92% moving stuff. In this case, our setup is actually based on the one-man crew. And so our camera angles will be this way and this way, and the all-important slider will be here. Hey, Sammy, how you doing? Great, Dan, how you doing? So on the one-man crew, we're gonna set up uh, Dave's F3, uh, and then Dave will be shooting Dan with an F5 and then I'll be shooting Sammy with two match C300s. We're gonna have uh, a Canon uh, DSLR up there for a wide shot. We've got a GoPro shooting a uh, time lapse and then we may stick uh, even yet another camera up. My name is Elliot Kirschner, I'm a producer. I still feel that there's a place for a real big production. Making it as rich as possible, making the, the visual elements as rich, I think that it, it just it just says from the beginning, okay, you know, this is something I need to pay attention to. You know, this wonderful, like, neat little device we have with the, the you know, the tracking shot that goes back and forth. I mean, you know, it, it just, it adds so much production value. No matter having the right equipment and the right people to know how to use it. We start with quality. We want a quality interview. We want a quality shoot on the set. We work hard on the lighting. We spend a good deal of time about camera positions, how the camera, any camera is going to move, it moves. We have to look state of the art and beyond. I haven't seen any of these work. I don't know. Where'd you come from? Right <laughs> <laughs> Under a rock. We want all the cameras to have a really dynamic and appealing look. When we set the one man crew up, we usually don't set it super fast. It's actually almost imperceptibly slow you know your subject's not going out of focus or out of frame. And the background is really dynamic as it moves back and forth. 